Hey everybody, it's John with Freshwater Systems. Today I want to talk to you about an argument that has been going on in the industry for as long as I've been part of it, and that's a long time. Is RO water safe to drink? The argument stems from whether it's safe to drink RO because it sucks all the minerals out of your body. RO water is low in TDS because that's what it does and it will also reduce pH slightly. So water that has very little TDS and has a slight acidity to it, it is going to be fairly aggressive. And the folks that have been arguing that RO water is not safe, that is their basis, that that aggressive water will suck all the minerals out of your body. Well, not really true. Although the World Health Organization recently did a study, and I think we could argue how valid the study participants were. Apparently they were a group of folks that had to go to RO water because their water supply was no longer safe enough. And they studied it to find out whether or not these minerals being removed from the water was going to harm them. And their finding was that they really needed extra minerals and I don't know that they ever addressed what their diet was because water is not a primary source for minerals. Uh, you know, the body really doesn't have a great way to absorb inorganic minerals which is what's in water. But they did find and released in their study that the RO did remove some of the minerals from their body. They didn't give us any kind of degree of removal, they just said it was removed. Now, conversely, the Center for Disease Control, the CDC, states that reverse osmosis is one of the most effective water treatment devices to put in your home. That's because reverse osmosis has such a broad spectrum of reduction. So it's great for getting rid of things like arsenic or uh, chromium-6 or and lots of other harmful contaminants. So the choice is, do you leave all of those in the water so that you can get minerals, or do you get everything out and possibly add the most beneficial of those minerals back in? That's the point in my mind that's the best. Get the best of both worlds. Get rid of all of the contaminants, the stuff you don't want to drink, and add back in the primary minerals that you do want. There's a lot of equipment out there today that allows you to add a remineralization cartridge to a reverse osmosis system so that you can get rid of all the nasties and add back in the beneficials. Now the remineralization cartridges work best in tandem with reverse osmosis and here's why. Reverse osmosis takes most of the inorganics out 90% or better. And that aggressive water now, we want to pass through these remineralization cartridges, it's easy for me to say, and give it the most residence time. The more contact that that RO water has with this mineral cartridge, the more extraction it's going to get and the more calcium and magnesium is going to be put back into the water supply. Now systems that are built with the remineralization cartridge in it are probably going to give you the best results because they've placed that cartridge where the water is moving the slowest. That aggressive reverse osmosis water is going to get those minerals back into the water supply if it has a lot of residence time in the cartridge. So as membranes make water, it's pretty slow. That's the reason we have a storage tank at slow flow of water through that cartridge is going to give us the best extraction so we get the most mineral back in the water. If you don't have a built-in system, you can add one to an existing system. Depending upon the design, if you have the ability to put an inline mineral cartridge between the membrane and the storage tank, that's best. If you have a manifold system, then you're going to have to put the unit, the inline cartridge, between the manifold and the tank, which is okay. Or if you have to put it between the system and the faucet, 
that would be the least effective because the flow rate is a lot faster there and the, we're not going to have the, as the same amount of contact time with the mineral. If you're not sure the best location of a remineralization cartridge, give us a call and we'll help you figure that out. I hope you got something out of it. Like this video, subscribe to our channel, and check out our remineralization cartridges at freshwatersystems.com.